God is moving. It's Young People Nation. Welcome to Young People Nation. Listen to us weekly as we commit to bring transparency, healing, and truth to the everyday situations in life that might bring you down. Join us for your weekly dose of inspiration. Thank you for listening to Young People Nation. Make sure you subscribe so you never miss an episode. And now, here's your host, Eugene and Donna Perry. Let's go. Christ is the foundation. Know his word gonna lead us. Know I'm already going. Taking steps I believe in. Giving guidance to the youth. Giving guidance to the lost. Give the world to the project. Lead them back to the cross. Well, this is a different place with us with Young People Nation. We're live this time. And so we are here with the gentleman who we connected with through Pastor Unique Mackey and uh, David Bash and Get Up Production. They have been our guiding light to help us because we didn't know what we was doing when we got this, did we, honey? Oh, no. <laughs> we, we was like, God was like, do a podcast. We was like, mm-hmm. what? But God connected us with David Bash. Hey, Mr. Bash. Uh, hey, guys. How are y'all doing? We're doing great. We're oh, yeah. doing great. We're wanting to end and begin with the, so people will know the people behind this podcast mm-hmm. of Young People Nation. Now, um, you've been with us from the very beginning. Mm-hmm. So what's some of the nuggets that, um, you have captured. So there's a couple things I've seen from you guys, mm-hmm. and then there's a couple things I've seen from the show. Okay. So I'll start with the from you guys. Okay. okay. Um, it's been really interesting. A lot of you know, a lot of times when people talk about having a support system or a support mm-hmm. network or something, it's like, yeah, you have it, but it's like, how active are they in, yes. in what's going on? And mm-hmm. something I noticed about you guys is. You know, you got this group me, you've got this group text, and you got these people that come in and they give their opinions and they help any way they can. Yes. And so you guys seem to really have the ability to build a really diverse network, which is something that is very hard to do and mm-hmm. is very hard to maintain. You got people, if I'm not wrong, all over kind of the country yes. that are supporting y'all yes. and involved. And that kind yes. of, I think, speaks to the mission of what you guys are doing. I think that's really yes. cool. Yes, it is straight from God. God, I'm telling you, it's, we didn't know. And, and dealing with mental health, which during that time for us, it was kind of a, uh, a healing journey for us. And so uh, my husband and I, as we talk, you know, it's kind of like, you know, God has many ways of helping us. Mm-hmm. You Man, know, I thought it was by my magnificent personality. Well, that's in there too, baby. But okay, you know, wow. we um, couldn't be a show without that. No, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm, it's me. It's, 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 it's me. You know? He said it's me. It's me. It's me. Yeah, it's me. Like, no, like, like my grandson. It's me. Yeah, me. <laughs> me. But um, we we were just so honored to connect with you. And one thing we love about you and your team is that you guys are. Uh, if you're, we text you all a spot on, mm-hmm. it's no no lingering. Yeah, you keep you it know. real. Yes, and so we are so grateful for you guys. Thank you so much. So so some of the guests we've had, and we've had, gosh, how many recordings we've yeah, two minute account. We we've, we've had a lot of recordings. So mm-hmm. which ones kind of stuck stuck out to you for mental health? So I'll. Take, before I answer that specifically, I think one thing that's super interesting about the show that you mm-hmm. guys have been able to do is, you know, I talked about, you know, how diverse the support group is, but you guys mm-hmm. have also had a really diverse group of people on the show yes. and a diverse group of stories. Mm-hmm. And I know you kind of started with, you know, let's kind of, let's, let's break it down with a mental health counselor and let's like really get that professional information out there. Yes. But then we started, I remember we had some conversations and it yes. was, we need to be telling people stories. So it's relatable so that people can see themselves in those stories. Yes. So, I mean, I love anything Michael Fortino does. Um, you guys yes. know that he yes. was, oh, yeah. he was a producer. He heard you guys yeah. doing the show yes. and then he con- connected with you guys. Yes. And, Became a guest, which I thought, yeah, Yes, I mean, anybody that's heard Michael's story is, I mean, his story is very inspirational. Yes, it is. Yeah, real life. Real yeah. life. Um, yes. and, and very relatable in a lot of ways. Mm-hmm. Um, 
on the other side of things too, the diversity of having a guy like uh, Brian come in yes. and share his personal story and and basically a fight back story like, hey, I was here and I fought my way back up. Yes, mm-hmm. yes. And then in another episode, being able to see a young couple who are just getting started on the journey and yes. see the other side of that. Yes. Um, to me, that's the cool part about the content you guys have been able to do is like, yes. if I'm young, I can see myself reflected in, you know, Kiara and uh, Khalil. Yeah, yes. And if I'm if I'm kind of in my journey and in my life, I might see myself in Brian. And if I'm trying to, you know, figure out who I'm going to be and get my stuff right, then, you know, I'm going to see Michael. And then if I just want to learn, you know, I can go to the very beginning and, and you mm-hmm. guys are teaching us principles of mental health. So I think the diversity of people is what's really stuck out for me. Cool beans. That's my son. That's my son talking. Over there? Yeah. Right okay, that's there. your son? Right over there. Okay. Right Uh-oh. I, I didn't claim you him. adopted in the family. I didn't claim him. <laughs> I appreciate I appreciate that. Yep. That means a lot, man. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't dump him before Christmas. You know, and then pick him back up. I'm I'm excited <laughs> to see what you got me. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> I am too. <laughs> you know, during the course of the of the podcast and all, you know, you meet you meet many great people. Yes, and great situations, and we couldn't imagine how it was going because uh, when we first started, we had had no clue. When God told us to start this thing, mm-hmm. I was like, "Who me?" He said, uh, <laughs> you know, and God spoke back, you know, you remember the burning bush in the Bible? <laughs> um, Eugene, um, do you need me to visit like that? <laughs> I said, no, God. And, but but uh, what about, and then God told me, you remember that time that uh, you went and did these things and you couldn't sleep for three days? And I said, yes, sir. And he said, well, do you want another experience like that? <laughs> or you fell asleep praying? Asking for forgiveness? Yes. Yes. After after 72 hours of no sleep. I would not sign up for that. (laughs) No. no. I'm going to leave that to you. God does not play. No, he doesn't. He doesn't. He doesn't. He didn't didn't help to uh, throw me off the building and shoot me or nothing. He said. (laughs) That's that's real. Yep. I'm just going to glance. I don't have words for it, but it's I'm just going to glance over there and you can't sleep for three days. And we're going to see how you like that. <laughs> I see. Yes, sir. Guy has a unique way of dealing with all of us. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Well, and that's, but when you guys came and you had your vision, which I think is another thing that's very notable is mm-hmm. like a lot of people come in, they're like, well, I think I, I kind of know what I could do, but I need you to tell me what to do. Mm-hmm. You guys came in and you said, I have a very specific vision. Mm-hmm. We have our mission statement. Mm-hmm. Very, very professional. Mm-hmm. You came in through Unique, so I knew you guys. I knew you guys were serious because yes. I knew you came in through Unique. Yeah, and, uh, and 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 I think that was really unique to see. Your question wasn't, you know, what should my mission and vision be, and all these because those are hard questions for us yes. to help somebody with. Yeah. Your question was, we know this. Now we just need the connection piece yes. to get us yes. from right. here to there. Yes, right? and those. Yes. Yeah, I mean, we love working with people that have stories like that. Yeah, the community that we surrounded ourselves with, um, mm-hmm. Dr. Austin, Yvonne Jackson, yes. who helped us, um, uh, we um, talked with people that they're already doing this. Mm-hmm. You understand? So uh, we knew what God was showing us. We began to understand at this point in our life the importance of mental health yeah. and how God has many ways and you know, some people, they had just given up on, you know, I read a scripture. I, I do all these things. I fast mm-hmm. and pray, and I'm still ready to, to take myself out or take this person out. So one thing God gave us, which was our experience, was you you need to go talk to a counselor, okay? You need mm-hmm. to talk to the right counselor. Sometimes you have to take some medication. Uh, we had to learn to do a reassessment. Yes. And so we just, we're so grateful to God for you and Get Up Production and your team, Charles, Michael, um, y'all were the three. The, the big three, yeah. yeah the big oh, three, yeah. Big three. Oh, yeah. And, um, we'll we, introduce you to Ethan in the new year. Okay, oh, okay, okay. okay. And um, when we, Michael, how he shared with us his journey, mm-hmm. and we was like, wow. And he, what, what really helped us, uh, or what blessed us, I'm going to say, when he said that listening to the podcast helped him to draw closer to God. 
I was like, wow. Yep. So that speaks to just the importance of having that. Like, you mm -hmm. know, a lot of people want that, mm -hmm. you know, they want something that they can consume or something that they can add to their routine. Yes. But you have to give it to them and, and you right. have to be a trusted, a trusted advisor for that person yes. in order for them to, to take that journey with you. So mm -hmm. just putting that out there for somebody looking for it is so yes. valuable. Right. Yes. But we're really grateful for you. Oh yeah. We're so grateful. You and your team, you all are just, and when I talk about you guys to, um, other people to ask us about the podcast. I say, hey, I got his number. If you know. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, Come and, on now. And, and Thank he, you. He will, he will make sure you're good. Thank okay? you. Okay? And so have you captured anything about your mental health? Did it help you to the, see anything? The thing that, that I've noticed, because I, you know, all of us are on, a, are on our own mental health journey, whatever that is, Talk individually and with people, right? Yes. Yeah. The thing I've noticed... Um, in the last year, I'm not going to directly answer, but I'm going to answer. Okay. Um, <laughs> is being able to kind of acknowledge where you are mm -hmm. is, is the most important step. Yes. Um, for me, that, that's was very difficult in my past to say mm -hmm. like, Hey, you're in a tough place. Cause it's mm -hmm. like, I don't know what, I don't know how much you guys have seen on social media and YouTube and TV about, mm. you know, owning a business and doing all this stuff, but you're supposed to be Iron Man, right? Like yeah, you're, you're right. not, you, you're supposed to hustle 14 hours a day, Yes, uh, you know, and you sleep two and then you go back and then you go and, you know, you just keep going and you keep mm. going until you get it. Mm -hmm. And they don't show the hard part about that. And they don't show the part where you actually don't want to be there yeah, for right. that whole time. <laughs> <laughs> they make it seem like you, you want to be there. Mm -hmm. And so understanding like, this is who I want to be in relation right. to what I'm doing. Yeah. And then, and then starting to bridge that and, mm -hmm. and find a little bit of personal mm -hmm. peace mm -hmm. for me in this last year has been really important because it's like, I've had to come to the realization that if I'm not on my stuff personally, if I'm not who I need to be personally, yeah. then if mm -hmm. I step in here, I could work 24 hours a day mm -hmm. and I'm not going to get what I could get done in eight to 12 hours right. yes. if I am aligned and centered and focused and I know what my goals are. So that's been my real shift over this year. And, mm -hmm. and hearing, you know, I think Michael's story for something like that is just an incredible story yes. to hear because for him, it's like finding what that purpose is because he... He is that guy that, you know, he's on a movie set mm -hmm. 16 hours straight yes. right. because he is so passionate and he wants to be there. And so yes. there was a movie that came out recently. And if I knew the name, I would say it. But he was a production assistant. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, um, someone has sent it to me. It's on Peacock. People yes. can find yes. it. Look yes. up Michael Fortino on IMDb. Yes. Find his mm -hmm. Peacock movie. Yes. Um, he wasn't supposed to be an actor in that movie. He was just a production assistant. Yes. Mm -hmm. But because he worked so hard and he networked so well. Yes. And, and he just brought his passion to the forefront. They made a part for him to put him in that movie. Wow! Just because of that aspect, and and so I think that's just a great illustration of like you never know what's going to happen. Exactly. If, if right. you if you're in the right place, be in yourself. Yes, and do the work. You got to oh, do yeah. the work. Yes, you got to <laughs> do the work on yourself. You yeah. know. Yes. Because often we like to blame other people for our own problems, but we can mm -hmm. be our own worst enemy. And it's okay to blame other people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if the next step is looking at yourself too and being like, they didn't do this whole thing. Yes, I did yes, some of this. Yes, I and I allowed didn't. it. Yeah. 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 Taking, taking self ownership because you can only change you. Right. You know, David, um, David, David is faith. And, and he believed that his faith that is tested mm -hmm. is worse than, is worth the investment. Mm, and doing the investment of, of his business, his time, his passion, it really pays off. Yes. Because as we go forth uh, through time and labor with this, people are delivered. Yes. People are saved. Yes. People are changing their life for the positive. Yes. And that's what it's all about. It's not about me. It's about them. Yes. We care about people. Yes. And that's how we are able, able to take a step forward. Well, thank you, David, so much. And, you know, as long as the good Lord got us doing this, you, you ride with us, bro. <laughs> you on the saddle with us. We're yep, not we're yep. not changing partners. Yep. Well, thank you so much. You know, obviously, we love working with you guys. Um, 
And, and I think you guys, if anybody is watching or listening to this and they're like, how, you know, they're like, man, I wish I could be doing what the Perry's are doing. It's Mm -hmm. like, well, it's really not hard to do what you guys are doing Mm -hmm. if you create your mission and create your vision and work hard and find the right people. There you go. But it sounds hard. And and y'all are a great example of take it one step at a time. You know, you build the base. The base tells you what the mission is. The mission yep. tells you what the vision is. And then yes. you find the people that you need. And you guys are a great example of how anybody could do that. Well, we're grateful to God for all the the homemade pound cake. I like this. <laughs> there you that. go. There you go. Somebody's a flour, somebody's a sugar, somebody's yeah. a sifter, somebody's mm-hmm. an oven. Yep. So it takes um, uh, a community yeah. of people that generally care about you to get done what God is telling you to get done. Yeah. You you put the best person on the mic. You put the most professional whatever person on the mic, if that person doesn't have a community and they don't have a mission and they don't have a vision and they're just doing the thing to, to do the thing that, you know, they're not going to get as far. David Bash and Get Up Production. Thank That's, y'all. Th- those are our folks. Thank y'all. Oh, yeah. Merry I Christmas. I <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy holiday. Everybody be safe. Yep. Please be safe. Oh, yeah. Yep. I, think, I, think it, I can't take credit for all that, but I give y'all all the glory. You got all the glory, and uh, hopefully we can make a difference in the other people's lives. All right. Well, thank you all so much, and thank you, David. Yep. Eugene. This last recording. <laughs> Eugene, you're going to close us out? You got to close give, us give out, us man. Give us one of your, yeah, your you, wordings. Come on. One of my wordings? Yeah. yeah. Well, it's like this. There are no great men, but there are great women that push us and guide us to reach the next step in life. And I got mine. You need to get yours. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> What's Amen. He, well, uh, and this is Young People Nation. Your thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he got so caught up in that. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah, was, he was I'm all looking, over here, but I love it. I'm looking at my wife. Yeah, you know, forgive me. I'm looking at my wife. I forgot what I'm going to say. But, uh, you know, this has been Young People Nation. And remember, there's always hope. Go. Christ is the foundation. Know he's where it gon' lead us. Know I'm already going. Taking steps I believe in. Giving guidance to the youth. Giving guidance to the lost. Give the world to the project. Lead him back to the cross. He the number one prospect. He the top, top boss. I was broke, I was empty. He the one to paint the cost. Really thought that I was cool. There was nothing like the savior. Now it's time for the truth. The whole world been waiting. It's your people nation. 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 The whole world been waiting. Whatever you going through, I know what he gonna do. No matter the circumstance, we going back to the room. Keep going, keep going. Let that seed keep growing. You need peace and we know it. Now it's time to live holy. Young people nation. You know what time it is. Young people nation. Get ready, the time is here. Get ready, we vibing here. We about to let God in here. Young people nation. It's young people nation. Yeah, do it for the heavens. You know where we going. Influenced by his love, you know we gotta show it. It's time to put the youth on to what God is doing. Cause I can tell you now, right now, that God is moving. It's your people nation.